Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Indian School of Physics. This is Nitin here and today I have come with a very amazing problem. It is 100 year old SHM problem from uh, Cambridge. So as per the record it was uh, framed around uh, 1923, maybe a little earlier. So it's slightly different from uh, regular SHM uh, problems and uh, you can unlock one more uh, 100 years old uh, sizzling problems in physics with the 500 likes target in this uh, video. And guys, you have been supporting so much. Thanks again. And uh, liking, sharing, subscribing is love. So keep sharing. And the more you will share, it will be helpful for me. It will be helpful for you. It will motivate me to make more and more videos for you. So guys, this video is brought to you by Indian School of Physics and uh, Unacademy together. And uh, guys, my current courses on Unacademy are Ayn Petro Foundation. And for J Advanced 2023, we'll be starting... Uh, circular motion and uh, work power energy in couple of days emerge for uh, J2023 in this batch we will be starting kinematics uh, within this week and uh, advanced problem solving course for J Advanced 2021 in two phases we have covered so far and uh, third phase will be starting around 15th of July advanced course for J2022 in Hindi is uh, currently going on we are doing current electricity and uh, the next topic will be magnetism and uh, course on rotational mechanics is already going on uh, we are uh, midway in this and guys you can access my last year's theory courses which are of advanced plus plus level for boosting your j preparation you can unlock these courses on an academy using my code nitin sir and for more info you can visit www.unacademy.com and guys trust me physics will never be the same again so here is the statement of this uh, problem since the problem is very old i have just taken the same wording as it was given in the source and uh, guys give it a try and let's see how many of you can uh, get the right answer or you can understand the proper language of it so a heavy particle is supported in equilibrium by two equal uh, elastic strings with the, their other ends attached to two points in a horizontal plane and each inclined at an angle of pi by 3 to the vertical the modulus of rigidity is such that when particle is suspended from any portion of the string, its extension is equal to its natural length. The particle displaced vertically by a small distance and then released. Prove that the period of its small oscillation is 2 pi under root of 2L by 5G, where L is stretch length of either string in equilibrium. So the language wise, uh, slightly it is dif uh, different because uh, it's a very old problem. So the language of that time and uh, now it's quite different so first thing which you should notice uh, here is when the author is referring it as modulus of elasticity so actually what he is meaning is modulus of elasticity per unit length is uh, defined as uh, spring constant as per the author they are related to each other cross section area also comes like in uh, present time we take modulus of elasticity as young's modulus so y a by l this is your uh, k so this kind of uh, confusion may come but uh, it's proportionality wise it will be same so i am taking its uh, spring constant as k so since uh, they are telling any length you take and you suspend a particle it will give uh, extension of same length l naught such kind of string is present so kl naught is equal to mg or uh, the lambda is kl naught here all right lambda is modulus of elasticity so now here in equilibrium you can see uh, the stretched length is given as l see we have to express our answer in terms of this length l right instead of natural length of the string we have to uh, express final answer in terms of this stretched length in equilibrium so uh, here let's balance the forces mg is downward and this uh, k delta l so delta l will be l minus l naught so you can see here 2k l minus l naught cos 60 is equal to mg and here this k is lambda by l naught and lambda is uh, mg here so if we equate this we are going to get l minus l naught by l naught is equal to 1 or in this situation here this length is 2 l naught this is what is given to us in this problem now we are displacing this particle by a distance of x <coughs> So we have to approximate this. Uh, see, normally uh, what we do in these uh, problems, uh, we drop a perpendicular here and we take this as uh, 
extension we take this as x cos theta and uh, we write f restoring as 2 k x cos square theta and uh, by that logic answer was not matching so i have to approximate uh, this problem to a greater extent so we will be solving it with proper method and in the final steps we will be using the approximation because you would have seen many in many books this type of question where uh, spring or elastic string is present and uh, this length and this length we will drop perpendicular and the extra length here uh, which will come that is going to be uh, x cos theta so new force we can write in that uh, situation anyways let's uh, proceed here at any general x if i write now the new length i am taking for the string as uh, l1 uh, and uh, l1 <clears throat> here is the instantaneous length now at uh, general x so my uh, restoring force will become minus 2k times because one force here and one force here 2k times l1 minus l0 cos of theta 2k l1 minus l0 cos of theta minus mg this is uh, the equation let's call this as equation number one so one by one we are going to find this uh, new value of l1 and uh, theta in terms of uh, x so you can see in this diagram if i use this uh, pythagoras theorem if i use this uh, uh, pythagoras theorem here you can uh, see uh, this uh, l1 square is equal to l by 2 plus x whole square plus root 3 by l uh, by 2 whole square so when i use approximation i'll ignore these uh, higher order term so my l1 square will come as uh, l square plus lx and further i can use binomial uh, approximation here so l1 comes as l plus x by 2 approximately because uh, in order to prove shm we have to bring everything in terms of uh, proportionality wise x that's the reason i'm keeping it in this form and similarly cos theta i can write cos theta is going to be in this uh, triangle and this angle is theta so here you can uh, see this so l by 2 plus x divided by l1 when i try to solve by using taking this angle approximately as theta i was not getting the answer uh, what they are asking us to prove so that's the reason i'm uh, going ahead with the more approximation here cos theta is l by 2 plus x divided by l1 now when i substitute the value of l1 obtained here and uh, simplify finally you can see i'm getting i'm not explaining the calculation part here the approximation part you can check this i'm going to get cos theta is equal to half 1 plus 3x by 2 now once i get the value of cos theta length l1 i am going to substitute this value in f restoring expression so 2k l1 minus l0 cos theta minus mg so what i am going to do is k becomes lambda by l0 where lambda is mg so i can directly write mg by l0 and mg if you take common l1 is l plus x by 2 l was the equilibrium length of the string please remember this and l0 is the natural length of the string so when i substitute these values i'm getting in this form and we have derived l was actually double of uh, double of natural length so here if i further simplify this i'm going to get 1 plus x by 2 l0 by rearranging this term and 1 plus 3 x by 2 minus 1 2 l0 value i'm going to substitute as l because final answer we have to express in terms of l uh, so when i simplify lot of terms are getting cancelled and uh, i'm getting minus mg times 5x by 2l so f restoring becomes uh, minus of 5 mgx by 2l or time period comes as uh, 2 pi under root of 2l by 5g this is going to be the final answer for this problem so i hope guys you have uh, learned this uh, problem it's uh, easy but yet uh, because the form in which it is given slightly language was uh, confusing and also uh, we have to derive something so we have to take approximation accordingly so guys uh, if you have enjoyed this problem please uh, like it share it and uh, let's reach the target of uh, 500 problems asap and uh, uh, very soon i'll be releasing the cylindrical uh, lens problem also in community post you would have seen i have given the problem statement so so far i haven't received any uh, correct answer in that problem so keep trying 
I'll be coming up very soon with the uh, cylindrical lens problem. Thank you.